Hey loves, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, this is Miron. If you've been here, thank you, thank you so much for always supporting me. So today's video is going to be all about this hairstyle. I'm going to be showing you guys the braiding pattern and how to crochet. So if you really don't know how to twist, then this is the best style for you. I do not want to talk too much, but I want you guys to see how I do this style. And yeah, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And without no further ado, let's get to the video. This tutorial is finally here. I posted a short clip on my IG and everyone went nuts about it and everyone was asking when I'm going to be dropping this hair tutorial and finally here it is. I think I also did this last year but I did not do the hair tutorial but a lot of you guys were asking about the hair tutorial and here it is. I'm sorry for delaying but yeah here I am. okay you will need to patch your hair into three parts so the front is going to be having two parts and the back you're going to be having one whole part so you guys can see i did the first line with two braids so the next line is going to be having at least three braids and you want your line to fall on top of the braid that is on the bottom because you want it to be like the brick method like you guys remember the brick method which is do not um put a parting on top of a parting or do not do a line on top of a line so your parting or line should go in between the section below like you can see the line is going directly between the section that is on the first line below So that is how your braiding pattern should be you should always use the brick method because the brick method is going to make your braids or your twist more balanced so if you want a balanced braiding pattern make sure you use the brick method and you will love the result So on this tutorial i'm going to be using a uh, mali hair i used on my previous tutorials so apart from the mali hair you need your crochet needle and you need your scissors so i wanted to mix the black mali hair with the 127 um mali hair like i've been saying guys mix and mix different colors of braids so i thought why couldn't i do this with my mali hair so i mixed the black with the 127 and you can see it looks nice the blend is not really really bad it's really really nice so i'm going to be showing you guys how to do the crochet twist so if you really don't know how to twist this is the best method for you because it's very very easy and this sale took me like i think let me say two hours because of filming but if i wasn't filming i think i would have taken um a shorter time now let's head to the installation part 
um after mixing the two braids together we are going to crochet through the braid onto your hair then after that you start twisting so keep on watching guys because later on i'm going to be showing you how to tuck in your own hair into the braid but for now i'm going to be showing you how to add extra hair onto your twist so you take your extra braid that was set aside then you just put it onto your twist then make sure you blend the extra twist with the actual twist then just keep on twisting like you were until you reach the end so it's not really really hard but once you get the hang of it i think it's going to be easy easy for you I know you're so eager and anxious to know how to tuck your own hair into the extension of braid you are using so remember guys i'm using Mali hair on this tutorial and um, because Mali hair is quite fluffy i'm going to be taking my own hair or braid and tuck it in into the extension then you just keep on twisting like you always twist so make sure you twist you first twist the two strands into the same direction then take them to the opposite direction that is how you get a really really nice twist also as you keep on twisting you might feel like your own hair is coming out of the extension what you do is you just tuck it in again then keep on twisting and that is just it about twists and all that so i've basically given you all the tea on how to do twist on how to add um, your extension or braid to your own twist like I've literally given you all the tea on this hairstyle guys So I hope you love this video. Give me a thumbs up if you love love this video Also, let me know in the comment section if you would try this Hairstyle out and we are not through with this tutorial guys. We are going to be spicing up this hairstyle Yes, we do not have time to be basic so yeah you guys know i'm extra when it comes to this hairstyle so i thought of putting these gold accessories on the tips to make it look more cute and vibrant and spicy yes so sadly guys this is the end of this video and i hope you got to learn something new from this video and i think i used one and a half a pack but i think two packs are going to be enough because these braids i used on this hairstyle were one of the braids that or remaining from a previous tutorial so for the 127 the blonde color it was one full packet and the black one was a half a packet and i have this remaining but the black is over but the black was like half a packet it was not too much so this is what i'm remaining with so i really don't know how to estimate how many packets i used because i used hair that was remaining from a previous tutorials but this was a full packet so i think Two packets to be safe if you're going to have them thicker than this but i like them um thin a bit thin and not too thick they're just medium and all that so so i got the braids from natural hair kenya in case you are wondering i got the mali hair but you can use afro kinky you can use kinky hair any kinky hair you have you can use to get this look Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Give me a thumbs up. Yeah, if you like this video, you can let me know in the comment section. Is this something you would try out? And until our next video, bye.